if you want to know the best teen movies, you should definitely watch our picks for the best ones of the 2000s. Oh, it's like slang from England. So if you're from Africa, why are you white? Oh my God, Karen, you can't just ask people why they're white. We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good movie again. Number 10. Adventureland 2009. Hey. Hi. You guys want some of this? I bagged it from Paulette. Cuban Thanks. rum. In 1987, James Brennan's dreams of a summer European tour before studying are ruined after his parents have a severe career setback. Adventureland is a 2009 comedy drama movie directed by Greg Matola and stars Jesse Eisenberg, Kristen Stewart, Ryan Reynolds, and Martin Starr. As a result to the setback, he takes a job at his local amusement park, where he falls in love with a witty co-worker, Emily Lewin, and finds the perfect course to get him prepared for the real world. Thank you so hey, much. What? I got a ride. You can go. Good night. Uh, you got a ride? Yes. All right, then, uh, then why don't you uh, ride this? Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, all right, I'll see you, brother. What the hell was oh. that? It's just my life. Number nine. Holes, 2003. I think we got something. We got something nice. We got something nice. We got something nice. Yeah. Holes is an adventure comedy film directed by Andrew Davis and stars Sigourney Weaver, John Voight, Patricia Arquette, Tim Blake Nelson, and Shia LaBeouf. This star-making performance and beautiful family adventure follows young outlaw boy Stanley, who can't help but break all the rules. But when sent to a detention boot camp to become a better teen, he quickly realizes that he was sent to hell. Digging holes the whole day in the desert, an adventurous mission calls when he breaks the rules one more time. Next! Don't get your hopes up. Them storms never make it past the mountains. There, maybe this time they will. Number 8. Charlie Bartlett. 2007. Susan, this is my mother, Marilyn. Such a pleasure to meet you, Susan. Oh, yeah, you too, Marilyn. Charlie Bartlett is a comedy drama film directed by John Pohl and stars Anton Yelchin, Hope Davis, Kat Dennings, and Robert Downey Jr. Led by powerhouse performances and an irresistibly charming premise, this coming-of-age comedy was also the inspiring influence for surprise series like Sex Education, Charlie Bartlett, a nerdy loner, has trouble fitting in at a new high school. But when appointing himself as a student psychiatrist, he quickly becomes the famous kid. But what's the price for lying about your abilities? Yankee Doodle. So basically, he ran out to stop the truck and it just drove right over him and killed him instantly. Are you fucking with me? Number 7. Mean Girls 2004. Why don't I know you? I'm new. I just moved here from Africa. What? I used to be homeschooled. Wait, what? Mean Girls is a 2004 teen comedy film directed by Mark Waters and stars Lindsay Lohan, Rachel McAdams, Amanda Seyfried, Lacey Chabert, and Tina Fey. Having recently moved to the States after living her life sheltered in Africa, Katie finds herself under the wing of ultimate A-listers, the plastic, the popular, the Mean Girls. All seems fine until she ends up falling for Aaron, the ex-boyfriend of Regina George. Now it is survival of the ruthless, and as the saying goes, only the strong survive. I'm only eating foods with less than 30% calories from fat. It's 40%. Oh, 48 over 120 equals X over 100, and then you cross-multiply and get the value of X. Whatever. I'm getting cheese fries. Number 6. Lords of Dogtown, 2005. Didn't bring any money today. Yo, why'd you come into my store then, asshole? Hey. Lords of Dogtown is a 2005 drama directed by Katherine Hardwick and starring Heath Ledger, Emil Hirsch, and Victor Rasuk. The film follows a group of young surfers in Venice, California throughout the 1970s. The bold Z-Boys become local sensations and find a new practice area to perfect their signature pastime, skateboarding. But what began as a hobby soon became a professional business and puts the cohesion of the group to a test. These are urethane skateboard wheels. Hey, you're a what? <laughs> urethane, man. It comes from oil. From oil? Yeah. 
With these, you can do the same hard turns that you do on your surfboard. Yeah? Yep. You can even climb walls, man, because they grip. They grip? They grip. They grip. Number five. Brick, 2005. Hey. What are you doing here? Just listening. Brick is a neo-noir mystery film written and directed by Ryan Johnson and stars Joseph Gordon-Levitt, Nora Zahentner, Noah Fleiss, and Megan Good. This ultimately fresh and innovative throwback to classic noir detective movies will surprise you with an unlikely setting, a high school. After receiving a mysterious call from his ex, loner Brandon is told her dead body was found. Convinced to solve the riddle on his own, he infiltrates school cliques that he normally avoided, accidentally leading him to trouble with a drug kingpin. Number 4 Ghost World, 2001 How many times I tell you? No shirt, no service. Get the hell out of my store. What do you think this is, Club Med? It's America, dude. Learn the rules. <laughs> Ghost World is a black comedy drama film directed by Terry Zwigoff and stars Thora Birch, Scarlett Johansson, and Steve Buscemi. With a star-making performance from its leading cast, Ghost World delivers on smart and refreshing teenage comedy. As a coming-of-age story, the movie follows two young high school girls who look forward to their graduation. But as they reach the end of school, the two friends must decide what paths they want to choose and if they can walk them together. You know, it's not like I'm some modern punk dickhead. It's obviously a 1977 original punk rock look. I guess Johnny Buckface over there is too stupid to realize it. I didn't really get it either. Everyone's too stupid. Number 3 Juno, 2007. You're pregnant? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And if it is any consolation, I have heartburn that is radiating my kneecaps. Juno is a coming-of-age comedy drama film directed by Jason Reitman and stars Ellen Page, Michael Sarah, Jennifer Garner, Jason Bateman, Allison Janney, and J.K. Simmons. Completely shattering audience expectations with what might be one of the smartest and simply funniest coming-of-age dramas of the century, Juno tells the story of a teenage girl who suddenly gets pregnant. Hoping that a failed rock star and his wife will adopt the child, her plans get her in trouble when the father of the unborn child falls for her. Juno, I'm coming with you to meet this adoption couple. You're just a kid and I want you to get ripped off by a couple of baby-starved wingnuts. Thanks, Dad. Boy, I thought you were the kind of girl who knew when to say when. I don't really know what kind of girl I am. Number two. A Walk to Remember, 2002. I need help with my lines. Landon Carter's asking me for help? Yeah. A Walk to Remember is a 2002 coming-of-age romantic drama film directed by Adam Shankman and stars Shane West, Mandy Moore, Peter Coyote, and Daryl Hannah. Wholesome and truly beautiful, A Walk to Remember follows uninspired senior high school student Landon, who stumbles through life aimlessly and gets into trouble. But when meeting the woman he always dreamed of, the two form a bond that is stronger than anything he ever felt, leading him to learn lessons that some people wouldn't learn in their entire lifetimes. Please. Okay. One condition though, Carter. What's that? You have to promise you won't fall in love with me. That's not a problem. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. I'm all wet. Can I come in? Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, uh, <laughs> this is Danielle. You must be Eli. And Klitz. Right. Roller derby? This is, this is tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I know. Will there be cute boys there? Hey, Mom, Dad. Um, we're gonna go to a football game. How long did it take you to grow that mustache? A couple of days. I wish I could grow one. Are you gonna eat your tots? Number one. Super bad, 2007. It's my last chance, and I fucked it up. Your last chance to do what? To make you my girlfriend for the summer. 
Superbad is a 2007 American coming-of-age teen comedy film directed by Greg Matala and stars Jonah Hill, Michael Cera, Seth Rogen, Bill Hader, Emma Stone, and Christopher Mintz Plus. Seth, Evan, and Fogel are three teenage guys who desperately wish to get laid. When a girl asks Seth to get the drinks for her party, he sees this as a perfect opportunity. With Fogel's new fake ID, the trio plan out how to get the alcohol, but things won't go smoothly for them. Forget with me if you were sober. Look at you. Look at me. Seth, come on, you didn't blow it. I think maybe... What the fuck? Help me. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular movie in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.